Welcome to Days Gone, it's Abyss, and in this video today, I'm going to show you all the collectibles and miscellaneous objectives for the Cascade region. When you pull up the map at the bottom left corner, you will be able to get the Cascade region to 100%. Now when I say miscellaneous objectives, I'm talking about ambush camps, hordes, Nero injectors, infestations, and all collectibles. Alright, so the first one on the list is the encampment jobs. After a couple story missions or so, you will be able to pick these up to the left of the bounty counter. So when you get to Copeland's camp, you'll be able to pick up the five characters. First one will be story related. And once you're done talking to them, you'll be able to pick up character number two and number three directly behind them. Character number four and five will be behind the mechanic. Now in the pinned comments, I'll have timestamps for each individual part, just in case you wanna to jump to any part of this video. Also, I label these in the way they appear in the menu. This way you can cross check the ones that I have listed with the ones that you have collected. So we are going to start from the Copeland's camp and we're gonna go around in a big circle and pick up everything in one continuous path. This way I'm not gonna make you go bouncing around from this point of the map to that point of the map. Uh, I'm just gonna go in one big circle and we're gonna go and pick up everything so that you will have 100%. Keep in mind, I will be in and out of this video in certain parts to explain more. How's it going, D? A lot of Manny. I came tearing through like a my experience. Ain't nothing zen about repairing your bike. Trying to block their doors. All right, so we are at our first Nero checkpoint and this one is story related. The way I like to complete these is I will jump on top of the building, cut the two speakers. There might be one or two more on top of a booth, cut those, but these are fairly simple enough to complete. All you have to do is find some gas, fill the generator, turn the generator on, and then you'll be able to get inside the building. Once you're inside there, you'll be able to get a Nero upgrade for your health, stamina, or focus. And there also is a Nero Intel number 29. Now I did not pick up this Intel in the video, uh, but I do swing my bat exactly where it's at. They are typically just a couple feet away from the upgrade. Uh, but if you do wanna check and see if you have this one, you would look up Nero Intel number 29. Son of a bitch, you better start. Yes. Sterile bandages, sterile bandages. Where the hell would they keep this shit? Yes, sterile bandages. Just what the doctor ordered. Now I just gotta get this back to Boozer. How? Oh. Hello. This Nero tank. Ah, uh, 
Some sort of a injector of some kind. Oh, why the hell not? All right, so this is the first of eight hordes that I'm going to show you their location. Some of these will be fairly easy enough to complete. Others you might want to consider coming back at a later time when you have a little bit more powerful weapon. Now, if they're not at the locations that I show you, that means they're moving around. But this particular one, they're right there in the house. And this one is very easy to complete. All you need is some grenades or a pipe bomb and you'll want to aim it right inside there and you'll kill a majority of them right away. So for this particular one, I will show you me completing it because it is going to be very easy. All right, so this is the first of three ambush camps that I have in the video, and this one is story related. They are simple enough to complete. At the top left corner of the screen will be a total of enemies that you need to defeat. After you take out all the enemies, you will have to enter a bunker and then interact with a map. The nice thing about this is at the end, you will get a craft recipe. And for this particular one, it is a spike bat, which is very useful. This has got to be the generator, but it's been shot to hell. Okay, that should do it. Here's the hatch, yeah. Neat. Hello, a map. Looks like they marked it up pretty good. All right, so for this is going to be a Nero research site. Uh, nice thing about this is you'll get another upgrade and you'll find a Nero Intel there too. But I do have to kind of warn you about this because there might be a horde inside, even though the next part of the video, I will show you where I found this horde, but there could be one in here too. The horde likes to wander around and it could end up coming back here or it could be outside the building. But just be aware of that in case you come running in here and you walk right into a horde. <laughs> uh, I just don't want any kind of surprises for you. Ooh. Ooh. That'll do it. A micro recorder. Let's see. All right, so I will also show you where the herbs are and they will be on a path as we're going along. 
Uh, there's only six of them that you need for the 100%, but there will be more than six of them in this video. That's it. You're done. How do you like that, huh? Being ambushed, you like that? You murdering sons of bitch. Here's the hatch. Yeah, knew you had one. Hello, a map. Looks like they marked it up pretty good. All right, so this is the Death Train Horde. The story kind of brings you over here. Uh, I already made a separate video guide on how to complete this with an early strategy. So if you want to check that out, I'll have that link in the pinned comment. <laughs> Injector, just what the doctor ordered. Mm. Yeah, that's the stuff. Another micro recorder. One of these is going to explain what the.
Micro recorder, hello. All right, so this is the first of two infestations nest. Uh, this one is the Pioneer Cemetery, and the story will actually bring you here. I'm going to show you the three nests that you need to burn uh, in order to complete this. But keep in mind, you probably want to complete this story quest here and then go around and start looking for all the collectibles. Most likely, you'll pick up a couple on your way. So just cross check the ones that I have in the order and then see if you have those and then go around and pick up the ones that you didn't get. Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. The start of this living hell that is now our life came as a surprise to no one who was listening to me when she. Evacuate farewell. Yeah, how that works.
Another Nero injector. Good. Oh, no. Micro recorders. Yeah, wonder what happened here. Mm. Yeah, that's the stuff. Push this truck out of the way. Huh. Uh, that does it. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Yeah, a Nero injector. Let's see if it still works. Mm. Yeah, that's the stuff. Another one of those micro recorders. Yeah, wonder what happened here.
here in the hole. Come on, boys and girls. Let's do this. God, you like that? Huh? Come on, you sons of bitches, come on! Looks like the kind of place you want to call home, yeah. God damn it, what you all shit yourself at once? Jesus Christ. Oh, goddamn freaks. What the hell are you doing in here? Huh? This place is a death trap. Come on, guys. Injector. Let's see if it still works. <clears throat> Micro recorder. Hello. There's a hell of a lot more where they came from. I gotta kill them all. Every last one of these murdering sons and bitches. Ugh. Caps clear. There it is. Down the hatch. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. I had too good a day, Cope, to let your shit spoil it for me. A map. Looks like they marked it up good.
All right, so the last thing we need to complete is a Nero research site, and then we will have the 100%. Now, this one is a little tricky to do. You're going to need to get a lot of speed in order to make this jump, but I was able to get it done before visiting the third camp. So what you see me do right there is just kind of get some speed quickly. I'm going to boost at the last second and then pull back on the bike to make the jump. Once you get to the other side, you'll pick up an upgrade, a Nero Intel and that'll complete the 100% guide. Other than that, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to support the channel and I will see you next time. We got the shittiest products cheap foreign labor could churn out. Everything in the last <clears throat> well, I was feeling a little under the weather. Another micro recorder.